now today we'll do question number 7a of exercise 3.1 just look at the questions here in the 7 we are asked to find the x plus y plus z here the x y and z is the exterior angle isn't it and 30 and 90 is our interior angle bitra particular angle or bira particular and this um, when you'll add this three exterior angle how much will get that we are asked to find now here also the same thing just look at here give the name give the name of the angle uh, for the triangle i've given a b and c and the four line i've given d e and f clear and so here we have given angle a is equal to 30 degree angle e a is our interior angle we have given 30 degree angle b is equal to a it's not given so uh, we can give the variables ourselves so angle b is equal to a angle c is equal to 90 degree angle c a d equals to z just look at here c a d that means this is z and angle e b a is our y and angle f c b equals to x degree now in order to find this x y z first we have to find out this interior angle a so just look at in triangle first we have to take the triangle a b c forget about the lines just look at this triangle a b c and we know the sum of the angles of a triangle is always equal to 180 degree triangle ko your tinta angles or the will get 180 degree so our angle is angle a plus angle b plus angle c is equal to will get 180 degree so we know the value for a that is 30 degree plus b it's our a and c is our 90 degree equals to 180 degree now here in the left hand side we have two numbers we can add this to 30 plus 90 will be 120 plus a as it is equals to we have 180 degree so we have to find out a we have to transfer 120 to the right side so the sign will change a equals to 180 minus 120 degree so a equals to 60 degree therefore we'll get a is equal to 60 degree now here we got all the three interior angle now so we can find out the exterior angle x y and z first d a b just look at here d a b this is our straight line straight line ma jai le pani angle kati degree form unche dui ta angle jodda 180 degree so here DAB is a straight line we know some of the angles form in the straight line is always equals to 180 degree so which two angle we have to add that is our angle CAD DAB ma do it angle form this that is CAD plus angle A is equal to will get 180 degree and CAD means Z CAD ka value ko this Z plus angle A is our 30 degree equals to 180 degree. So here similarly we can find the value for Z. Z is equal to 180 minus 30 therefore Z is equal to 150 degree. We got one exterior angle that is Z. Now in order to find the exterior angle Y similarly uh, take the straight line CBE. Just look at this C B E. This is also a straight line. Similarly, we can add angle E B A plus angle B equals to will get 180 degree. And E B A is our Y degree. Plus angle B is our A degree equals to 180 degree. So Y co value we don't know. Keep it as it is. Plus A means just now we got A is 60 degree. Just put the value for A that is 60 degree equals to 180 degree. So Y equals to we have to transfer plus 60 that will be minus 60. So Y equals to 180 minus 60. Therefore Y is equal to we got 120 degree. Now we got Z, Y. Now we have to find out X. 
Similarly, ACF, you have to take this line. ACF is a straight line. So here also if you add two, two angle, we'll get 180 degree. So angle FCB plus angle C equals to, we'll get 180 degree. So FCB means X degree plus angle C is our 90 degree equals to 180. Now X, fine gonna lie, we have to transfer plus 90 to the right side means the sign will change so x is equal to 180 minus 90 therefore x is equal to 90 now we got all the three exterior angle x y and z so according to the questions questions ma'am like even this uh, find x plus y plus z you find going on this and marked it equation number one like you got a equation number one banana marked got now put x is equal to 90 y is equal to 120 and z is equal to 150 in equation number one in order to get the sum of exterior angle clear so our equation number one is x plus y plus z now we got the value for x y and z put the value in place of x we can write down 90 degree plus in place of y we can write down 120 degree plus in place of z we can write down 150 degree so in the next stage if you'll add we'll get 360 degree therefore x plus y plus z equals to we got 360 degree and similarly you can do question number b also 7 could b you can do it yourself similarly you have to follow the same steps and try to do question number 7b.